Lee, it's been a real pleasure to work with you, and you've done a fantastic job for everybody in Ohio. Thank you, Kathleen. Kathleen, congratulations on your retirement. I think back on the debates we've had with the administration, several administrations, about issues related to health care reform. I can't imagine being in some of those arguments without your expertise in the field of insurance. You've represented Ohioans very well, and I think the lives of many Ohioans are much better because of the work that you've done. It's been a great joy to work with you. I wish you all the best. Continued success. I really just wanted to take a minute to say how really grateful I am to have had the opportunity to learn and work with you since uh, I think 2008 um, when I was trying to figure out how to re-enter the workforce after having stepped out for over 10 years. Uh, you may not remember but I uh, I came to Columbus and had lunch with you during the time when I was doing some contract work with Voices for Ohio Children and I was trying to figure out, you know, should I do this Michigan program for a master's? What was looking good? How did you manage your contract work? How did you um, work as a consultant? And you were so generous with your time and with your thoughts and, uh, and offered some guidance and some really good tips and I really, really appreciated that. And I have since now had the opportunity to work with you for, oh gosh, all since 2011 really, when I started back uh, with legal aid and was able to convince them to let me do policy work. And I've learned so much and I am so um, really appreciative of your willingness to take the time to bring me along and help me be part of the movement and uh, in a helpful and productive way, I hope. And I don't expect this to be goodbye by any stretch of the imagination since, as you said, healthcare justice kind of gets into your bones. And so I'm looking forward to continuing to work with you since we haven't yet achieved all of our goals. Um, so uh, thank you again, and just know how, um, how much you've been appreciated and will continue to be. Hello Kathleen, it was great knowing you all these years. You have done a super job to promote healthcare coverage for all Ohioans to the fullest extent possible. Though you are leaving, you can. I know you will be around here to promote the cause. Good luck with all your future plans. Wish you all the best and I'll see you at the You Can Gala. Thank you. Hello Kathleen. For your tribute, I want to say that I am aware that you have an unusual combination of integrity, insight, and I think compassion. And you have really made a big difference in the health field and a much greater difference in my life. Uh, there really is no one like you and I consider myself very lucky and I love you. Hi Kathleen, you're catching me on a vacation, but I would be remiss if I didn't take this opportunity to thank you for all of your support and knowledge that you've shared over the past decade with me. And um, just thank you for being a tremendous mentor to me and an advocate uh, for those who need your assistance. Thanks so much for all that you've done. I just uh, want to thank you so much for all the work that you've done. Uh, with the OCHC and every time we've needed to do anything in the healthcare arena uh, you've been uh, willing to help us and always made sure that we were kept up to speed. We appreciate uh, all that you've done here uh, especially uh, to make sure that uh, we were aware of uh, all the immediate things that needed to happen. I will tell you this you will be greatly missed. Uh, thank you again for all the help you've given us and uh, from Toledo and Northwest Ohio, the best of luck. Thank you. When I was thinking about making this tape, I thought of the best description I heard about you came from you. That was when you said working on these health issues are 
it's in your DNA. And so I thought about it and I thought that if D stands for determined and N stands for nice and A was your activism, that DNA does work. So for you to share your experiences, your determination, your niceness, your activism with us is one thing that has made my life more enriched by having spent time with you on our coalition work. I think we've been able to make some great change from the hard hats on the front of the roads building to now fighting to keep uh, the ACA around. Thank you for all your work that you do and have done and will continue to do to make sure that the citizens of Ohio and the United States have health care. Thank you. No exaggeration. You can Ohio would not have grown to have the impact it did on implementation of the Affordable Care Act without you. I mean, you wrote the proposal that got us the grant that enabled us to build Ohio Consumers for Health Coverage. And then you built the coalition. You, you created the foundation and the documents. You, you did everything. Um, to keep that, to build that coalition into a strong voice. And, you know, um, I, I think about how meticulous you always are about details. And when you're making policies that are going to protect people's lives, the devil is in the details. And unlike anybody else, you would wade into those details and make sure that the promises made to people were kept in the details. And uh, you just have such a strong ethical core to you. It, it's been an amazing journey to work with you because, you know, even when you story bank people, you didn't think it was ethical to have people tell their stories so we could give stories to the media without solving their problems. So you'd spend days and days figuring out how to get them what they needed. Um, you just, you're just this ever ready bunny of justice and passion for justice and caring about people. It's, been an amazing ride. I can't wait to see what you do in, in the next phase of your life. And I hope I'll be a small part of that. Well, Kathleen, I'm sorry to be participating in this endeavor. endeavor. Uh, it's a sad occasion, but at the same time, I'm deeply honored to do so. You and I have known each other a long time. Yeah, you were in legal services in Michigan. I was in legal services in Kentucky when we met. And then years later, we reconnected when we both got involved with UCAN. I remember very well those early days when you and Kathy and I talked about health care reform in Ohio. It would have been the middle 2000s. Uh, we got funding eventually from Robert Wood Johnson. We started Ohio Consumers for Health Care Coverage and began working. Uh, to develop a health care plan for Ohio. I remember our early decisions, how to structure the coalition, its leadership, you as executive director, Kathy and I as co-chairs, following on the work of the Family Coverage Coalition. But I remember our work with the Strickland administration, all that we did to develop a state plan modeled on Massachusetts and then uh, quickly pivoted to the federal level with Obama's election and his deep commitment to reform at that level. Uh, we worked very hard in Ohio to find votes for the Affordable Care Act, and we worked even harder to implement the Affordable Care Act, especially the Medicaid expansion. Kathleen, through that whole period, you, you led us with your deep commitment to uh, dealing with the challenges posed by the complexity of health care reform and just as much as the moral issues raised by it in terms of its impacts on real people. I've always been proud to be associated with you. It's been a great pleasure. More than that, it's been a great honor. 
Kathleen, and I really mean this, you exemplify as much as anybody I know the servant leadership that is so desperately needed in our society. Again, I'm honored to be a part of this uh, endeavor. I hope that you have a wonderful future. I miss you. I miss seeing you. I miss working with you. And I know that you're going to be greatly missed in Ohio. So once again, I wish you the very best in the future. I love you.